I'm Bill Smith, although I sign all my work as W. Custer Smith because there's too many Bill Smiths and it was getting mixed up with other people. get into work very much until about 2000 when I joined the uh, National Wood Turner Association. The National Wood, Sur National Wood Turner Association is a, a nationwide organization. They, about 1970 they came up with new material and new ways of holding wood. It, it has changed tremendously since my first term. In high school I was majoring in industrial arts, and that's where I did my first wood turning. Then I went to college at the same college, Rothenberry uh, College. Uh, I've only attended for two years, but I majored in industrial arts and did a lot of uh, wood turning and uh, furniture making. But I, I didn't do any turning until after that, until about 1970, that's when I made the four lap. After that, it was about 19, uh, about 20,000 uh, 20, when I joined Central Florida Wood Turners, a or national organization, which uh, I attend regularly. And I've, te I've taught classes, I have uh, written articles for magazines. It's very difficult to tell you how long I've been turning. I say in high school, I turned one thing, then it was years before I touched it again. And then there were years before I did it again. Uh, uh, once I got started in about 2000 or 2001, I've done quite a bit. It's a habit. It's a habit for me, which is hard to stop. You want to do it from morning to night, and so uh, my wife doesn't see me some days, almost all day. I'm trying to wait. Many times I get my ideas of what I want to turn by watching television. When they interview someone, I'm usually watching the disc behind it, the vase, whatever is sitting behind it on the shelves, and I said, I can make something near that, like that. Or I go to free markets and see what they have to sell, and items like that, or to art galleries. I see other people's work, and I look at it, and I can see it make like that. It just comes up in any, from magazine, pictures, or anything, it gives me an idea I can make something like that. I also take magazines for wood turning, and they, they have ideas there sometimes that uh, is partial. The most memorable thing was I made a, a vase, a kind of a candy dish, I'm not sure what you call it. I got inspiration from a free market and I told the lady I'd like to copy what she had there. She says, you can't copy that. But I made one and took it back and she was amazed. I also took it to a a uh, seminar for wood turners, three days of seminar, and you're supposed to take three things to show. I took this one and I put it on the counter, and before it got set down, the lady says, I want to buy that, what do you want? I said, I don't know, I hadn't thought about it. She said, make a price, I want it. So I gave her a price I didn't think she would take, and it went left on the counter right then, and nobody else got to see it. We have an 
Art Walk on the first Friday of June. It's also June the 1st. I invite you to come and see all my wood turnings. I hope to do demonstrating at the same time.